So hi there everyone, welcome back to another episode of my Westwood City City Skyline series. My name's Leon, I'm the one looking after you. And yes, we're just having a look around uh, the bit we were building in the last episode. Haven't moved it on at all apart from what you're seeing now. Um, so yeah, growing nicely, developing. You can see all the amazing people who have moved into our town. Yeah, coming along nice, just going over the, the school and the medical area, up towards the fire station. It's, yeah, not looking too bad. Um, I have got a couple of ideas of things I want to do in this one. I do want to try and expand out a little bit if I can, but that will all depend on a few other bits and pieces. So this is just the industrial area. So... Let's cue the intro, and then get on with some more building. So yeah, we got, doing not too bad up top, population 975. Can we expand yet? Oh, we can. I don't want to go that way. Or maybe not, map flat land's not that great over there. If we went that way. Yeah. How much is it gonna cost us to expand? Five two. Yeah. There we go, so a bit more space. What we'll do then is we will take this road from here. more residential up there okay there's more industry wanted there like that take that one out and bring that across like that we can then lose those as well coverage oh I'm there probably as well I'm 
Now if I do commercial there, Oh, tiny town. Like that. We're probably going to need to put another school up here. To want is it there? Right, you're gonna have to get bulldozed. do for now. Bit weird looking but it'll do until we can get a proper bridge across. Money's coming in not, not bad actually. We'll put police station up there. there. Oh, we got a fire. Here comes the fire engines. Now with that nice and quickly. Of the fact is at the moment traffic is not too bad. I think because we've got plenty of routes. Actually, we've got another way in there technically. trees dog park put that in just to keep them happy more residential demand See, this is kind of going to be kept commercial because of that industry stuff. How are you looking? 4%. How much do we need for high school? 
24,000. If we took that... We'll pay that back. high school there. Okay, we haven't got transport on lock, got to reach a population of 2,000. Power's starting to now look a bit low. I need to put another power station in. residential at once. Not looking, I mean, I'm quite happy with the way this is going so far. What was it you need for that? 2,000. Well, that's 1,300. Getting population in. The problem is we've now not got enough, probably high, you know, skilled enough workers. Use most more, yeah, I'm gonna use most more money. And same as like we did in the last one, we just want to make sure no one is doubling back on themselves.
as I said this way, I just want to give them more options for getting into the, to the, the town. There you go, that's that bit hooked up. But that then also gives us access to that roundabout, which means we've got access to this bit of the coast as well. Um, how much do I need to get this started? better money because that would seem to give us industry. We've got forest stuff over here. Um, how's it looking over here? seen these roads being used at all. Not really yet. Seventeen hundred population. See I really want to get buses going because then I can put loops into all of this. thousand for that. Well, I'm going to get there. We're up to back up to four thousand two. Hmm. Education's fine. Fire coverage is a bit weak. something we've got to look at. <coughs> Awful weather. You definitely call it a, a downpour. Oh, rubbish is an issue. Where's rubbish an issue? Oh, it disappeared. demand for resident uh, more industrial we'll put it there which I could have put it there actually we could just put both in it doesn't cost me anything just to put the squares in oh the fire engine oh the fire engines did respond up here okay 
Well, that makes me think at the moment the town's fairly well covered fire. Elementary schools. Yeah, we're kind of covered. High school, kind of covered. Ten thousand for med. Oh, nearly enough for another medical centre. Which I think would be a good idea. Right there. Right, what's wrong with you? Not enough educated workers. <coughs> yeah, I kind of agree with that. I can't do much more at the moment. More residential required. I think what we'll do is up here So they are 960. <coughs> oh, excuse me, well, I got tickly throat. It gives us homes up in the kind of like this kind of in amongst the mountains and oh, more residential, more commercial demand. It just all seems to be kind of working at the moment. Oh, there you go, 2,000. Right, that's unlocked buses. How much is that going to cost me to put a bus station in now? Bus depot. Put it there. Yeah. Now, just as another building went up, so we'll put you next door to him. Right, let's put. bus line. Right, I want that's going that way. Okay, so we'll put one there, one there.
Actually, no, we'll go down this road. Let's make sure that all works. Um, we're going to change the color of those buses, though. I've got to have red buses to start with. This will be wood fod commuter. So that's the bus service up and running. Now that should hopefully also take some demand off roads as well. And of course we increase it as we see where else we need more. Um, fire coverage, I definitely need to increase that. But I need another 2,000, another 1,000 roughly. But it's residential demand again. the house is up in the hills how are the buses look let's have a look see if are the buses getting any well it's got one passenger but it's starting to pick up round different routes so they are. That's all good. So that'll start bringing in money as well. And as they spread out, at the moment they're still a bit bunched. I'm quite chuffed with that mountain, like kind of the houses up in the mountains as well. This kind of is quite cool. And we have got vehicles coming in on this road now as well, I've noticed. A bit too close to those junctions. Do that, so that's got water. Money's definitely coming in a lot better. I 
I just like the, I just love the look of those that area there already. I think once we get some more services over this side, that area will really grow. Just waiting for, I want to get a fire station in before we finish this episode. We're nearly there, we've got 10,700 and 10.8. Twelve thousand. Um, fire. We'll put it there. So that should, you know, again, see these houses grow and develop as well. Tell me now, we've got enough fire coverage. I mean, it's still seeing rubbish issue, but. I can't really do much about that at the moment, but we are starting to get your know, demands for some more housing and things like that. We we'll probably think about station some point. I'm probably when I get this. Actually, can I? Yeah, I have got an option for another seven thousand one hundred. Yeah, probably try and... Mm. See, that bit of land would be useful because we kind of want to get a station in. We'll have a think about that. But yeah, Woodford's coming along nicely. Starting to develop. Population 2,500, so not bad for two episodes. Come and join me for another one very, very soon. Hey, everyone. Uh, please remember to like, comment and subscribe if you've enjoyed this video and if you want to support the channel in any other way, check out the links in the video description.